blessing. He's in the blessing business. Oh yeah. If you don't know for sure that that's the case, just look around. As far as you can see, his blessings are there. So Father, this evening we thank you for life, health, and strength being as good as it is. Thank you for your son Jesus. Thank you for your Holy Spirit. Thank you for your word. Thank you for one more opportunity to get right where we've been wrong and to give you a true and sincere praise. Oh, Father, we thank you. We ask that you allow your Holy Spirit to manifest himself in each and every space place that this little broadcast is being played. And we ask that you would allow him to reach out and grab hold of us, bring us better to close under you. This we pray in the mighty name of your Son, Jesus, and the Holy Ghost of our witness. That all of God's children said, Amen, Amen, and Amen. Mm -hmm. Well, family, this week is almost over. And I pray you have taken the time out to tell the Lord thank you. Again, he is in the blessing business. So I say to you this evening, greetings to you, my brothers and sisters, in the name of our Lord, Savior, and indeed our Redeemer, Jesus Christ, welcome to 7-Minute Kingdom Building. I'm your host, CL Champion, pastor of Mount Mary Missionary Baptist Church in the blessed city of Sasha, Georgia, where we have in-person worship each second and fourth Sunday in the sanctuary. Uh, that's this coming Sunday, in case you're in, so inclined. Um, our Sunday school starts at 1030 and our praise and worship starts at 11.30. So if by chance you're in the area, feel free to stop in and help us uplift the name of Jesus. And I promise you, you'll be glad that you did. So uh, this week has been a topic of for the love of you. And tonight, we're going to give you a subtopic of what you won't do, do for love. Oh, yeah, I, I know some wheels are turning because people think, wait a minute, ain't that a song? <laughs> so tonight is Thursday, the 8th of December, closing out the year of 2022. If you would, join me in your Bible for the book of 1 Corinthians, chapter 16, just verses 13 and 14 tonight, where we find the following recorded. Watch ye, stand fast in the faith, quit you like men, be strong, let all your things be done with charity oh my lord what you won't do do for love finally uh there are some times when you just don't feel like helping and, and that's all right but when someone is in dire need if you can make the sacrifice praise the lord go ahead and do what you can you're not doing it for yourself you're not doing it to you know you're not trying to pick up bills for anybody but uh, I mean, Scripture tells us to do all things without murmurings and disputing. So in other words, if you can do it, do it from your heart and don't complain about it. Okay, another Scripture says, uh, with regards to Jesus, that he made no reputation for himself. Took on the form of a servant, was made in the likeness of men. All right? he, he, in other words, uh, Jesus being the most high didn't think it was necessary to put on a, a show to you know let everybody know who it is he's not trying to uh, uh, reach for any type of notoriety then we have another scripture that says that we shouldn't uh, take heed to do our arms before men and sound the trumpet <laughs> so in other words you want everybody to know that you're going to help this person whatever it was that you've done all right, so whether that person be a family member or even a stranger, all right, if you're going to do it, do it for love. All right, so now, and then we, have all, we always have, a, well, I ain't doing nothing uh, for nobody. I'm not going to do this, you know, because they're going to waste it. Again, our subtopic, what you won't do, do for love. Do it for love. Don't do it because of what you think they might do. Just do it for love. Now, tomorrow, uh, we will close out this week's series, and we're going to discuss 
God's love. Praise the Lord. So um, I hope that you've been receiving, and I pray that the Lord's word continue to bless you. So hallelujah, somebody. I'm praying to you right now, Father God, in the name of your son Jesus. We're thanking you for all that you are and all that you're doing and everything that you've done. Lord, we bless your holy name at all times, and we lift our prayers up to you for our family members, for our loved ones, for our friends, even for the ones who might call us enemy, Lord. We ask that we all are able to come together in the name of your son, Jesus, and that we might grow together, grow in your grace. So, Father, we bless your holy name, and we thank you. It's in Jesus' most holy name that we do pray, and the Holy Ghost is our witness. Father, we thank you. And all of God's children said, Amen, Amen, and Amen. So if you would, brothers and sisters, share this message with somebody. Uh, remember, Jesus loves you, and so do I. Praise the Lord. Searched all over, couldn't find nobody. I looked high and low, still couldn't find nobody. Nobody greater. Nobody greater, no, nobody greater than you. Praise the Lord. God bless you. Uh, hope to see you tomorrow night. Bye-bye.